I'm going to show you how to use a website called Hapara to interact with your students when they are either on a Chromebook or in using the Chrome browser in a lab. Uh, first thing you need to do is go to the Hapara website. Here you're going to be able to click sign in and uh, select your school email and say allow. It'll ask you to select a domain. It comes up as the correct AASD, STU AASD domain. And it'll bring you to a page with all of your classes. These are in chronological order. Unfortunately, the numbers don't mean anything, but this should be your first class of the day, second, third, and so on. When you click on a class, it will bring you to a dashboard. Each of the students inside of their Google Drive has a Hapara folder, and in that Hapara folder, you also have access uh, to a algebra folder. If students put things in that folder, you would be able to see them here. The sharing tab, uh, this is gonna pull up any documents that the student has in their Google Drive they haven't shared with anyone. So if you know they're working on something but they didn't turn it in, you wanna go see if you can find it, you can find it here. You can use this tab to change how many items show up. We can also go to the Interact tab. And this tab, um, the first side, is going to be Browser tab. So you might want to tell your students they can only have one tab open, and that is a Google Doc that they're working on. You could see if they were trying to go onto other websites here. You could also send an individual student a message. Or you could take a picture, a screenshot of what they're doing. If you want to send a website to a student, you click on this tab. If they found, lost a the resource, they're having trouble finding it, you could click it and copy and paste the URL, push open tab, it'll open a new tab for that student uh, where they're supposed to be. If you want to send a website to a whole class, click on this button, copy and paste the URL, send it to them, they're all on the same page. You can also use this button to write a message to the entire class. This current screen section will show you. It's not in real time, but it does show you what each of the students are doing, so you can check that out. Um, if you want, you could take a picture of that message um, as well. And the class info tab is very helpful. If you ever need student usernames, you can find them all here. <clears throat> and you have a list of all of the students email addresses which is huge if you're using a different service and you need to enter student email addresses for some reason or if you want to make uh, email list for all of the students in your class because you don't want to do individual sections in uh, infinite campus to email kids you can find them here um, and create them that way so if you have any questions about using Hapara please let me know